Assalamu alaikum students here we have the main page of microsoft excel and our chapter is introduction to ms excel if we install microsoft office in our computer or mobile phone then you can see that here we have microsoft excel the main page of microsoft excel is just look like this one there are many menus many options are there in the taskbar you can see there are also new file option new worksheet you can add the new worksheet from the start button or control n or from this icon now we edit a new worksheet we can work on this worksheet here you can see that the name of the worksheet is book 1 and here you can add the multiple worksheets by clicking on this icon now we have added three worksheets in our work here you can see that there are column numbers like a b c and d and so on and rows number are like 1 2 3 4 5 and so on now we can see that we can enter the data in any cell by dragging our mouse the particular cell is highlighted where you can enter any kind of data you want you can add integers numbers or any kind of data in the particular cell if you want to add multiple cells then you can drag from a particular column to multiple columns like this by dragging this you can choose you can select multiple cells to write on or to edit any data the entering data is very easy in any cell or you can click on any particular column to select the each column like a b c and d the address of the particular cell can be mentioned by selecting by mentioning the column number and row number like this here the address of this cell is e3 it means that it falls in e column and three rows the column and row number can be easily mentioned for any cell by mentioning the row number and column number here you can see that we can enlarge the size of the cell the size of the column by dragging the mouse by clicking the particular cell you can easily drag you can easily change the space you want to edit the data you can enter data here in any particular cell and you can change the column and column width and draw height also by entering the data in any sheet you can see that we have already mentioned the address of the cell of any particular cell 
and sheet number you can also save any of your sheet upon which you are working very easily to save the data on at any point you know that we have to save it for a further use so if you want to save any worksheet upon which you are working we can save this by clicking on the floppy and when we click on this floppy icon our worksheet is gonna save here is also the save option or save as option now the next bar is open to save your file you can save your file in the space where you want you can add the file name here and click the save option this is a very easy method as we have done already in Microsoft Word where we can add our table, our pictures or any graphs in our file. Here also we have so many options in this bar that we can edit our worksheet, we can change the color of our text we can also insert pictures, graphs or any shapes in our worksheet by clicking on this insert option we can see that we can edit the text by clicking on the insert option you can see that we can edit many pictures, graphs or clip arts and text also. Here we can edit our page, layout and how our worksheet will look like. These are the many options you can check by yourself by doing the practice in MS Excel. We can 